So let's talk about Sabalenka. So, some news coming out of, uh, of Berlin with Sabalenka retiring for the first time in her career. She's retired from an, an event or retired midway through a match, uh, which is kind of crazy. She usually fights for these things, but let's go have a look at why she retired and also look at the tweet that came out on the WTA Twitter account. This is what the WTA had to say. Semi-final bound. Anna Kalinskaya is into the final four after Sabalenka is forced to retire due to injury. And that injury was a shoulder problem that she got midway through the first set and she went down to double break 4-1. She ended up having to uh, get a medical timeout and then played one more game and then was to retire uh, after that one. So again, first time she's retired in her career, unfortunately for Sabalenka. So there it is. That's what has happened. So Sabalenka, along with Rabakina, both retiring this week. And they're the two favorites for Wimbledon. So it gives Fiontech, Goff, Jabir, those type of players, uh, maybe a better chance because the two big names who we expect to do well or even win the whole thing are injured. A shoulder injury for Sabalenka, that's going to really, you know, hurt her power. Of course, you know, she has such a powerful game. That's what she is, what is she needs to do to win Wimbledon. And Rabakina seems to have, you know, abdominal pain and stomach issues or illnesses. So... Who's going to win Wimbledon at this point? I mean, let me know if you're watching this later or you're watching it now. Uh, let me know. Who's going to win Wimbledon at this point? Because the two favorites are injured. The Queen of Clay is looking pretty good right now, even though Sviantec hasn't played any grass tennis. And then you've got Goff and Jabiru probably just behind that. Uh, of course, Vondi as well, another injury. The, uh, the defending champion also injured. So it's been a week of injuries in Berlin. And two of the three or two of the favorites are injured, including Sabalenka, who had to retire today from a shoulder injury.